Uh, can you speak a little bit about um, mathematics and spirituality and the connections between mathematics and spirituality? The connection between mathematics and spirituality? Yes. Well, I see, I see mathematics as like the, the ultimate description of the cosmos. And my feeling is that mathematics is pre-existing human consciousness. There are two views on that. Some people think that human consciousness creates mathematics, but I think we are discovering something that already exists. And it's really the description of how the cosmos unfolds. And I think if we ever discovered another extraterrestrial species and communicated with them and started asking them about mathematics, then once we had decoded their symbols, I think we'd absolutely agree upon what we discovered. So I think in that way it, it's fundamental. It's probably the closest we can get to the divine is, is mathematics. And I sometimes say, God must have been a mathematician. But I think math is almost inevitable. It's, it really springs from just the notion that there is distinction in the universe. There is duality. And then the mathematics is the description of the, of the duality. And the fundamental duality is one and one make two, or there is distinction. There, anything, one thing is distinct from another. And when you have that, you can have one and one makes two, which is almost, it's just a logical, obvious thing. I mean, you, in different number systems, one and one can make three or four, whatever, depending how you define the numbers. But basically, one plus one equals two of things together. And then from that comes the whole of numbers, from that comes fractions, from that comes decimals, from that comes irrational numbers, from that comes complex numbers. The whole thing just unfolds from that. So to me it's an intrinsic part of the cosmos.